Hello and welcome to New Filmmakers Los Angeles in partnership with Movie Maker Magazine. My name is Danny DeLillo and we're here at the Cambridge Los Angeles showroom in West Hollywood and I'm here with Harriet Feigenbaum with her movie Passage to Coney Island. Let's take a look at a clip. It's an absolute delight to have such a talented artist and filmmaker here today, and congratulations on uh, Pasha de Coney Island. Oh, thank you, thank yep. you, and you know, I love being here. It's oh, a, my your, first trip. And, your first trip yeah. from New York, isn't yes, it? It's amazing. That's right, that's right. Well, welcome, welcome here. And for those that haven't seen your film, um, tell us a, a brief synopsis of what your film is about. Uh, well, this film is actually a sequel to uh, the first one that I did. Uh, I've only done three, this mm -hmm. is the second one. Uh, it's a sequel to the first one that I did, uh, Coney Island Sinking. Mm -hmm. And they're really, they're about pollution and rising seas, something everybody is concerned with, um, in the neighborhood where I lived as a child. Yeah, I love uh, how you did it. It was, it was, it was really powerful, and I, I love your artistic vision. It's, it's incredible how you've moved into filmmaking. You've had such a, an amazing uh, artistic career as well, of like just been having, having your work displayed in museums and installations. You know, what was the point where you thought, oh, I'm going to bring my artistic vision into filmmaking? Uh-huh. This goes way back. <laughs> um, but I didn't do anything about it. As I mentioned, my twin brother um, is a filmmaker and uh, 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 does or did, he isn't doing it now, uh, animation. And he did a film, I don't know if you saw this as, as a... Uh, as a, you may have seen it as a child, uh, Hugo the Hippo, he directed that. Really? And yeah, there's a whole Hugo the Hippo fan club. Wow. Uh, that started in England. Anyway, he's, so he really knows his business and that, and that um, has been, I guess it was Warner Brothers that uh, has uh, brought it back, that did it, and Hugo it's on the their best yeah. of us. I mean, they're, they're doing very well with it. Yeah. Anyway, my twin brother, so. Uh, while I was uh, using hay as a medium for my work in uh, around 72, 73, and doing really enormous drawings and detailed, very detailed, but very quick details mm -hmm. uh, of, you know, the straws and so on, and uh, the straws began to, you know, the straws seemed to move. And so I said to my brother, you know, I said, what if I uh, tried to do an animation of this, of having the straws move, of, of doing, you know, I described what I wanted to do, and he's right way he knows his business he said well that'll cost you sixty thousand that'll cost you you know blah blah blah, blah. and that'll kind of said oh my god forget about it you know so, <laughs> and of course he was right i mean this is the business and he that he was in and this is you know this is the pre-computer yeah i mean i couldn't just sit down at my computer and do this right um so i forgot about it um until um you know but i had this sort of in the back of my mind and um, I was always very envious of what he was doing when I saw his work. He did a lot of commercials as well, as well as the uh, 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 Hugo the Hippo, as well as the animation yep. film openings, program spots, and so on. And they're all so interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean, making things move, all so interesting. And I was mm -hmm. always a little bit envious. Anyway, uh, in 2006, I got a computer. Not, mind you, not before 2006. <laughs> and I got an Apple computer. Um, and uh, I was at, at the Apple store. And there was a demonstration in the theater, in the Apple store, of uh, motion, you know, their animation mm -hmm. program. And I said, ah, oh, you know. A yes. light bulb. Yes, a light bulb. I said, oh, my God, I could do this on the computer. I could learn to do this on the computer. Wow. I didn't really get into it that much until 2010 when I got a larger iMac. Mm -hmm. uh, and I got Final Cut. I got the program, Final Cut in Motion. So you just like became first. an Apple expert, like, you know, you started applying your mind to it, you know, like a great artist does. And he made a film. Well, I'd like to think that I became an expert. Yeah. Uh, but I have, you know, really a lot to learn. You know, I love how this is your, your first trip to, to Los Angeles. And it's lovely that you've, you know, uh, you had your film, you know, uh, selected with us at New Filmmakers LA, which is an absolute privilege. Um, what one piece of advice would you give to any artist out there or anyone that is wanting to be, you know, a filmmaker coming from a sort of artistic perspective? Uh, that's an interesting question. Um, really get to know your medium very well and be careful about everything, not just the visuals, because one thing I learned from last night, and I don't know why I could kick myself, I don't know why I didn't notice it before, 
but my sound was awful. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's the, it's the, I just, oh, I just, I just couldn't yeah. listen. Gee, well, why didn't I catch that before? And my brother did make a comment about it. He said, you know, your sound could use some work, you know. And, and he it was absolutely right. And it's not that I hadn't seen it before, mm -hmm. but it just hit me. I said, oh, God, the sound is awful. Uh, so just to be, you know, aware of everything, not just uh, creating visual imagery, mm -hmm. but to be aware of everything that goes into making a film. Yeah, well, I mean, I, I, I think that's a very important factor, and we have to remember all the things, all the mechanisms that make a film and, and, and what it does, and, and never stop learning, you know, never stop learning and embracing new things. And thank you so much, Harriet, for sharing your film with us, and I'm looking forward to seeing the next one um, as well and uh, seeing your... Uh, more of your creative vision. So thank you for sharing us at for Makers LA. Congratulations. Thank you very much for inviting me. And by the way, when we finish here, my new film is on my iPhone. Oh my so goodness, I'll I'm going to see peek. a preview. <laughs> okay, well, this is coming very soon. Um, you have a website as well, don't you, Harriet? Yes. Yeah, what's the, what's the website? Uh, HarrietFeigenbaum.com Take a look, take a look, take a look. You thank can't you see the film much. on the website. You can't see the film. That's a preview for us right now, but you'll That's see right. it in the future. All right, yes. thank you, Harriet. I appreciate it. Thank you. Take care.